Um, I'm going to show you another little tip how to make a supplement that's totally natural for your pigeons and sheep to be able to keep them in good condition, help them through the mould, help them through breeding and just generally staying healthy, especially for stock birds or anything that don't have access or pigeons that don't have access to an aviary all the time. So as you can see, hopefully, uh, on the video, collect eggshells. Eggshells are full of calcium and a few other derivatives which I'll list on here to show you what's in them. Um, what you need to do with them is collect them, wash them, and then just put them in the oven or put them in the microwave for three minutes to kill any bacteria that may be on them and it makes them go very, very brittle and dry. You can put them in the oven as well, but it takes longer. And then what I'm going to be doing is, this is a little coffee grinder. You put them in there, and now the rag and bone man's coming around, shouting with his uh, thing. And I think we'll cancel it there. So, hopefully where we left off, this is just a coffee grinder. They're only cheap. Um, I think that one cost about eight quid or something off eBay or something. And what I do is a little bit extra than just giving them the uh, eggshells is I add some vitamin D3 and K2. K2 is there for helping the calcium absorption and the D3s there for the immune system, uh, especially if they, like I say, they don't get any natural light all the time and they're kept in the loft and only let out for an hour a day. The other thing that I add in is just a bit of uh, B12, which is good, again, for the system. Uh, it's about building energy and uh, keeping the blood working right and the muscles working right. And I add that in as well into the same compound that I'm doing. So, as I said, what I do is I uh, microwave the eggshells for three minutes to make sure there's no bacteria on them. And then what I do is put them into a coffee grinder. Hopefully don't spill them all over like I've just done. And then I add a couple of these, which are vitamin D3 and K2, uh, which is 5,000 international units of D3 and 100 milligrams of K2 twice obviously and then a thousand of b12 put them in together put the lid on and then then powder them once they're uh, powdered you've got your calcium powder with added vitamin D3 and B12 and then what I do I'm not advertising any of these by the way this is just an old container from years ago but I like the containers you put it in to a pot and you keep doing that. Obviously, I don't add no more vitamin D3 and B12 into it now. There's enough in there for this tub full. But I'll continue on and do all these, which I'm uh, these eggshells, which will take me quite a bit. And it's a bit boring, so you don't want to watch that. But you get the gist. This is now calcium powder with added vitamin D3, K2 and B12. A great supplement for your pigeons, like I say, for molting, breeding, uh, generally keeping them healthy. And obviously it helps with racing as well, because if they're healthy, then obviously they're working, uh, the bodies are working properly to help them race. Hope that's been help.
Right, I'm going to show you how to uh, mix it on the corn for those that don't know. I know it's a simple process and a lot of you will, but you never know. So, the faithful bowl, um, some corn, just mix it in a bit, put it in there. That's enough for about, I would say, about 16 birds. And then how I mix it uh, to moisten uh, the corn and then add the calcium B12 K2 onto there. It's five mils of cod liver oil is what I use. It's good for the Amigas. So you put that on which I've just done obviously and then mix it in like before like I showed you on the other one but this time it's cod liver oil you don't want too much but you need to make sure that the corn's covered so that it sticks and then 5 ml of our calcium powder that we made let's have a look so there we go and sprinkle that on and then stir it in Maybe just need a little bit more on to moisten it a little bit more. These uh, measurements aren't exact, but it's just to give you a rough idea. And now all the corn is covered, as you can see, covered in uh, the calcium powder. And then obviously you can give it to your pigeons. And I know people have been asking me uh, how much do I give them. Well, I only give them this roughly uh, when they're resting and that about once uh, once a week on the food, uh, one feed. Uh, but when they're under times of stress, i.e. breeding, molting, a couple of times a week helps them with the feather growth. You don't get deformed feathers um, and breeding. You don't get deformed bones and the uh, youngsters, the youngsters are nice and healthy. Um, I'm sure you've seen some pictures of me youngsters kicking about but uh, it, you need to give them the best start in life and these are the essential things that people sometimes overlook to make sure that they've got healthy youngsters. Uh, hope that helps you, thank you very much.